The 1974 film is about Frankenstein's grandson trying to disassociate himself from the family name. Dr. Frankenstein. Frankenstein. It's a cult send-up of horror films written by Gene Wilder. And it inspired the musical, which opened on Broadway a decade ago, closing two years later. Now it's come to the West End. Leslie Joseph plays the film's forbidding housekeeper. I am Frau Blucher. And Ross Noble is Frankenstein's henchman. You must be Igor. No, it's pronounced Igor. So when they were casting around for a sort of hunchback, slightly bug-eyed actor, they thought, I know just the yeah. man. Yeah, yeah, well, I first got the call and I went, oh, yes, young Frankenstein, the dashing, the dashing romantic lead. <laughs> it's what? OK. Um, yeah. Well, you know, Marty Feldman, um, yeah, had a very distinctive look Walk in the movie. So, um, yeah, it's great. I love it. I spent, Now, I've got to the point where I actually, um, it's more comfortable being fully hunched over than it is standing up. <laughs> The original show has been edited for the British stage, but the classic lines are still there. I don't wish to embarrass you, but I am a rather brilliant surgeon. Perhaps I could help you with that hump. What hump? What's it been like working with Mel Brooks? It's well, we, we were quite traumatised <laughs> the first time he came in because how much how much tape have you know, got in the camera? camera? We had it's two weeks without Mel, and then Mel came in and we did what we call a read through. Except it wasn't a read. No, you're ruining it. You're ruining it. He's, he's dead serious about it, and then you realise he's just taking a Mickey. So you never cut. You're never quite sure. So it's just like it's just a, it's, the whole thing's a, like it's hard work, but the whole thing's just a joy from start to finish. Young Frankenstein sparks to life this evening. Wendy Hurrell, BBC London News.